Okay, let's start. So, my topic is all about metallurgy, the continuation of my classmates. So, smelting and mining began in 4000 BC in Egypt. And the copper ores were mined in the Sinai Desert. So, we have an example for that. So, as we can see in the picture, Sinai Desert has taken a big part of Egypt. So, that, oh, dako, 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 yung Sinai Desert, no? So, I have an, I have an example of, I, I have a picture of Sinai Desert. So, this, so, Sinai Desert, so, magikita natin na purus lang siya, rocks, so, from the word desert, so, desert init siya, init. So, I have an example of copper ores. So, kanilang copper ores is, dito natin nakikita sa Sinai Desert na kanilang minamind. Minamind nila. Yan. Yan, copper ores. So, so, the copper obtained from Sinai and the other copper mines was used to fashion at this access arrowheads, so blades, drain pipes, and made from the strip of copper band around, and many other items. So, I have an example of item or picture, picture from the copper ores. Na mo niya nila, ito yung mga, mga gawa ng mga gawa galing sa copper ores sa Sinai Desert. So, first picture shows that um, tigib. Then, the second is satua is tubo, tubo. Then, the third one is arrowhead sa pana. Then, the, the last part is shows the so blades. So, gabas. Next. So, kan, it kanisila is coming from the stone or copper ores. Although copper ores were abundant in Sinai, Sinai, Cyprus, Caucasia, and Transcaucasia, but the problem in, in bronze making was the shorter supply of tin. So, although na ang copper ores is abundant siya sa Sinai, so dili lang dahil sa Sinai siya abundant na pa sa, sa Cyprus, Caucasia, and the Transcaucasia. But the problems... The problem in bronze is short sila og supply sa tin. So, what is tin? Tin is the best metal which best alloy and copper to produce bronze. So, alloy and copper to produce bronze. So, originally, it can be collected along with native golds and riverbeds. It has been sm smelted with blades, with black copper to produce bronze. So, so, ang kaning tin is makikita lang pala sa riverbeds. Oh, makikita sa riverbeds sa, sa lugar ng Cyprus, Caucasia, and Transcaucasia. So, mayroon pala silang river. So, next. So, this is the example of tin. So, this is kind also of rock. No? Rock that Mayroon siyang kumikislap na parang, parang, anong tawag na, parang isang diamante. Sun. Next. So, the second and the first millennia BC, when man learned about, learn, learned more about the properties of alloy, the tin's content of the bronze was adjusted to application bronze for mirror and such containing a higher tin percentage than bronze for tools where usually 10% was more proper so sa second and the first millennia BC is learn they learn more about the property of alloy so mas gina mas mas taas ang con content sa tin then gi-adjust nila ang bronze then gi-adjust nila ang bronze sa 
pagbuhat para makabuhat sila just like example of mirror so mirror then for for tools they adjust usual a 10% was more proper next as the major major supplied from the caucasia and asia mirror minor began to fail tin ores and black of tin were important. Poemnation trader went to far a Brittany in France o oh, sa so mga lugar ng Brittany in France Cornwall in England and even Bohemia in Central Europe to bring tin to the Near East Egypt did not east of oh. Egypt did not manufacture bronze on a large scale bef before 1500 BC. When tin supplies began to arrive from the west, the shortage of tin to alloy with copper to produce bronze was thus one of the major stimuli to long-distance trade, trade in the ancient world. Here was a foreigner foreigner of that cultural intercourse which was significantly to, af to affect enlargement of man's vision and thought. So, 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 gamay lang man nagsupply itong Caucasia and Caucasia nakipag kalakalan sila sa mga sa lugar ng Brittany, France, sa Cornwall in England and the Bohemia and Central Europe. So dagan sila, dagan sila ogi, dagan sila ogi, gipakal, gik kanang tawag na. Marami silang nag maraming nakipag marami silang nakipagkakalan sa ibang lugar noong 1500 BC. Dahil nga sa kakulangan ng supply. So, 4th century BC, bronze could not always compete with stone. The Egyptian, the Egyptian army continued to use a flint arrowheads partly because they have better penetration power than those copper or bronze. And bronze were scarcer than and expensive than flint. So, sa 4th century BC is ang yung kanilang the Egyptian army is mas, mas ginusto nilang gamitin yung flint arrowheads dahil mas power mas powerful than oh, then kung sa ito pa is ng sakit siya, then barato ano siya so this is the example of flint so the picture shows that this is the kind of rock the mm, so the first picture show that just like the arrowheads so second and the third one is the same so next do a scarcity and the high cost of copper and bronze in the in in the an ancient world have caused them to call to be called a metal of aristocracy whereas iron is said to be a democratic metal democratic metal practically every country in the near east and the early europe passes good and were able iron ores so iron tools were cheaper so cheaper and more widely used so mas cheaper siya then mas dugay ay mas 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 magamit pa nimo siya mas, mas mag widely nimo siya magamit once the technique of manufacture during iron has been mastered that was that was why there is no doubt that an asian smith has mastered the various technique working gold silver copper in its alloy bronze lead and antimony so asian smith so 
this picture is an an Asian Smith. Ito yung tag tagapag tag tagawa tig panday sa mga item or or just like nung kanina yung mga arrowheads mga mga blades mga blades mga mga gamit na mga tao na so ancient smith ang taga buhat anak sila so 30th century specialization had take shape and the beginning of malno metallurgy Originally, the smith had prospected, mined, and, and smelted copper ores, and then worked and alloy and the metals. Gradually, prospecting the mining were left the miners. The metallurgy smelted that metal from the ores, and bars and pig metal were then refined and alloy. Now, the metal was ready for blacksmith who will work to produce such common objects like pots, pans, and ordinary tools or for the copper smith. How produce sm smaller object, art object, or repaired certain glasses of metal pr products? So, so now, ang mga mga tigpanday or a uh, or a ancient smith or a blacksmith is the the producing such as a common like pots pans tools so sila na lang yung so noon is, is nagamind pa sila then ngayon is inihin, sila na lang yung tagagawa Tagagawa na lang sila sa, sa, sa 38th century. However, however, the early Iron Age metals, tools, and weapons were still expensive. So that stone, was, stone as well as wooden implement continue in use in such areas of production as the textile industry. So... So, metal, tools, weapon, expensive siya, kay, o may barato. So, ma mahal, mahal ang, mahal ni sila sa una, pero karon is mas ni mahal kay. So, makita naman na to na mas, ano, mas technology, hmm. Technology na nagaliyok, no? mas mahal na, mahal na mga bakal, mga appliances, mga gamit na from the, next, ay, that's L. Thank you.